violence and abuse in any form is unacceptable. It's essential that anyone who experiences violence against women, domestic abuse and sexual violence is provided with an effective and timely response by all relevant authorities. Your leadership is essential in ensuring the culture change that will make this happen. This has the potential to change and save lives. To ensure that this is provided, the Welsh Government are introducing Ask and Act. Ask and Act is a process of targeted inquiry across the public service for violence against women, domestic abuse and sexual violence. Its introduction allows professionals to be better able to identify the signs of these issues, to be prepared and to be able to ask their clients appropriate questions about them, and offer specialist help quickly. The aim of the process is to increase identification of those experiencing violence against women, domestic abuse and sexual violence, and to offer referrals and interventions for those identified, providing specialist support based on the risk and need of the client. Ask and Act is a vital part of early intervention and an important part of a multi-agency response which can prevent someone being subjected to further abuse. It is by far the most ambitious, practice-changing innovation linked to the Violence Against Women, Domestic Abuse and Sexual Violence Act. Ask an Act has been tested in two early adopter sites, the South East Wales Local Authorities and the Abertawe Bromorganug University Health Board. The findings from the early adopter sites has significantly shaped every aspect of the Welsh Government Ask an Act policy. Our aim is that Ask an Act is implemented in every local authority, health board, NHS Trust and Fire and Rescue Authority in Wales. Rollout will be phased and the Welsh Government will work with you to discuss appropriate timing for implementation in your area. Public services in Wales will be supported to Ask an Act in the following ways. Direct support from officials to inform planning. A Train the Trainer programme to ensure you have staff within your organisations and regions who can train colleagues. A small grants programme to engage expert support on the training programme where necessary. And through a series of guidance documents for leaders, managers and practitioners. One of the guidance documents is aimed directly at you, leaders of public services in Wales. It provides information on the four stages of work that will ensure Ask and Act is implemented with a strong infrastructure. Stage 1. Establishing governance. Stage 2. Planning, including the pre-training phase. Stage 3. Training. And Stage 4. Rollout. This guidance will assist you as you plan how your organisation can implement Ask and Act. Whether you will be taking forward Ask and Act this year or within the next few years, we strongly urge you to consider this guidance for your organisation. The Welsh Government will assist you along the way. Ask and Act is the practice change that will see Welsh Government legislation and strategic direction delivered at the front line. It requires strong leadership and investment, not just of Welsh Government funding, but the time and commitment of public service staff. As we prepare to roll out Ask and Act across Wales, we are beginning a journey that can change the public service approach to those who have experienced violence against women, domestic abuse and sexual violence. Together, we can identify more people in need, offer efficient and effective interventions earlier and improve the response to these issues. The role of managers, leaders and coordinators across Wales is imperative in creating this culture change. The value you place on Ask and Act and its importance within your workplace will directly relate to its effect and therefore its impact on those who have experienced abuse. For more information on Ask and Act, visit livefearfree.gov.wales.